Bobby Roman and welcome. Today we're doing a what I eat in a day, a full day of everything that I'm eating because you guys love them on my TikTok and my Instagram. I am a certified personal trainer, holistic nutrition coach, and a national bikini bodybuilding champion. So I'm gonna be giving you guys an in-depth overview of what I eat in a day. So as you saw from the intro, I always start my day with a full glass of lemon water and I'm actually gonna show you guys what I do to prep my lemon juice for the rest of the week. Um, I didn't have it prepped, so I just did like the full slice lemon, squeeze it in, but I'm gonna be showing you guys what I do to save myself time during the rest of the week when I'm really, really busy and I don't have time to cut, squeeze, all of that. And hopefully this helps you with tips to help you with sustainable habits and healthy eating and showing you what I do to make things a little bit more easy, simplified, um, to help it you know, be more consistent because results come from consistency, guys. You cannot get results unless you're consistent. So I'm gonna be showing you guys obviously what I do to help myself stay consistent and you know, making it part of your lifestyle. So after my lemon water, I always let myself have like 30 to 60 minutes of nothing after, no caffeine, no coffee, nothing. So what I do is I have my lemon water, go down to like my bathroom and I go brush my teeth and I make sure I'm all fresh and I do my makeup, do my hair. And by the way, this is from those like heatless curls that you do overnight. And I finally found the best one. I'll have it linked down in the description box for you. It's from Amazon and I had purchased one in the past and it was terrible. I don't know what, if it was from an ad or from Amazon, I don't know, but it was so bad it made my hair staticky. So I'm like, okay, I gotta get another attempt and do this. And oh my gosh, look at how nice. So I'll be doing this all the time because it's just so fun, so easy. Put some hairspray in and like you just get the most perfect curls. So without further ado, it's been an hour since I had my lemon water. So let's go and have a coffee because I love coffee and I actually have to refill my machine. So I'm gonna show you which is my fave coffee to have. And I just have black coffee, nothing crazy. And I love to sip on it while I make my breakfast. So my fave coffee, Illy. Classico. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to open this up. I love smelling that fresh can or bag of coffee. <laughs> so good. <gasps> Guys. Oh my gosh. This came off. How am I going to open this now? <gasps> oh my God. I have no idea how this is going to open. That would happen for this video. The little clip. I pulled these off a million times and it fully busted. Okay, I'm gonna ask Daniel how to open that. Luckily, I have an extra. <laughs> okay, so let's hope that this second one is brand new as well and does not have an issue taking the cap off. Oh, thank gosh. Whew. Oh my gosh, guys, fresh coffee beans. Like, can you, like, this is just the best smell ever. I'm gonna fill up my machine. I cannot believe that happened to my coffee. Cheers guys, I got my cute little A mug that my sister-in-law got me for Christmas last year and I'm so obsessed. Mm. I just love that first sip of coffee in the morning. It's just like the simple things just make you feel so good and just make you have such a good start to your day. Mm. So while we're sipping on that, I'm gonna get right to it. We are gonna be making my fave, fave, fave protein oatmeal, but it's PB and J style and I'm so obsessed and I feel like you guys are gonna love it. And again, all of my meals are very high protein, nutrient dense, combining all macronutrients. So that it means has your protein source, your carb source, and your fat source, fiber, nutrients, and I'm also gonna show you what vitamins I take as I go through my meals. So, let's go make my PB&J oats. Here are the lineup for all the ingredients. So, starting with my fave, unsweetened vanilla almond milk, this is my favorite brand. And then we're gonna make it extra protein by adding in some collagen. This is Total Radiance Collagen Powder from ETP Labs. You guys know it's one of my favorite brands ever. And again, it's just for extra protein, collagen, all that good stuff. This is unflavored, so you can really add it to everything. So I always add it in my oats. Pea Science Select, this is my favorite tasting protein. So ATP makes a really, really amazing, high, high quality protein powder and like vegan, beef protein, whole bunch. But for flavor, this is my fave. The Pea Science Select Protein and Gourmet Vanilla. So that's gonna be helping us flavor our oats without having to add any sugar. 
we have our fave, or my fave, <laughs> our, oh my god, I'm such a nerd, the Quaker gluten-free quick oats, love those, organic peanut butter, and this is the only kind of sugar that we're actually adding into our protein oats, which is just smuckers, and it is the raspberry, that's my fave. So we take half a cup of our oats, so half a cup, then you want to shake up your almond milk just in case it's settled to the ground or the bottom <laughs> and we do one cup of this and we will be adding some cinnamon i forgot to tell you guys that so i always add ceylon cinnamon and make sure it's ceylon so you have the most purest most amazing form of cinnamon and this also helps stabilize your blood sugar so cinnamon is literally in almost all my stuff <laughs> and then we just mix it all up I'm so excited for breakfast. It is literally the most amazing. You guys will be obsessed. It's delicious. Again, it's portioned out, it's balanced. Before anyone comes at me, oh, it has sugar from the jam. Guys, if you have everything that is balanced, portioned, like portion control, you can enjoy anything. Everything in moderation. I'm all about the 80-20 rule, and this is a very high protein um, breakfast because while that's cooking the oats, I'm gonna tell you guys. So the Collagen powder here from ATP Labs. So this has nine grams of protein from the collagen and obviously all the benefits of the collagen powder for beautiful hair, nails, and skin. And again, my discount code for ATP Labs is gonna be on the screen. It is Abby10 and you can get 10% off any of the items on their website. And then the P Science Select, you get 24 grams of protein per scoop and I always put one scoop. So it's one scoop of both. So that's literally 33 grams of protein in this delicious protein oats. There's a scoop in there, add a scoop of that to your oats. And then I do a full scoop of protein powder. And you just gotta really blend it and it makes it really fluffy. Now I'm gonna just show you this close up. I have my food scale, I got this from Costco. Make sure you follow me on social media because I do a lot of Costco hauls. Put my oats here, let me just angle this a little bit more. So, again, portion control guys. Now you don't have to be this type A, this is just because I have my bodybuilding background and I like to know exactly what I like to eat and put in my body. So I'm gonna just make the unit in grams. It's been zeroed out with this on, okay? And if you want me to do like an in-depth video on like how to use a food scale, I'll show you. But basically you put your food on, press on, grams, make sure it's zeroed out. Then we take our peanut butter. Now one tablespoon is 100 calories, guys, one tablespoon. So again, portion control. It's very easy to overeat your fats. <laughs> so I'm going to be adding a tablespoon and a bit. So basically 20 grams we're going to be putting in this. All right, so same concept, but now with the jam, let's just do the full tablespoon. So guys, this is the result of this ooey gooey yummy. PB&J protein oats with 33 grams of protein. I think there's probably gonna be 34, 35 grams because there's a smidge of protein in your oats. Not very much, but we'll round it up. 35 grams of protein just in this protein oats. So first I take my vitamins so I do not forget them for my breakfast. So this is all of them right here. And I will tell you what they are in a sec. My full glass of water. <laughs> I do them all in one bunch. So first off, this is my breakfast. You saw my protein oats, coffee, water, and then my vitamins. I have the vitamin D from ATP Labs. You guys have seen that from my top vitamins I recommend. I'll have it linked above for my absolute must recommendations for everybody's health and long-term health. So I have my one capsule of vitamin D. I don't take as much in the summer. I have my total defense, which is my multivitamin. I have my thorn folate, um, which I'm taking because I'm on my TTC journey, trying to conceive journey if no one knows what TTC means. So yeah, it's important to take folate. And again, if you guys have controversial uh, opinions on folate versus folic acid when you're trying to have pregnancies or trying to conceive, um, let me know in the comments section. I'm curious to see what your take is, but I personally, my own research, believe it's important to take folate. Um, so that's from Thorn, and then the other one is a Thorn um, B complex. So that's also important when you are trying to conceive. And I'm gonna be vlogging my whole TTC journey, so I'm excited to bring you guys that. 
uh, but I'm not pregnant yet, so no assumptions or anything. <laughs> so those are my vitamins, and then now I'm watching Keeping Up With Kardashians because I was late on the train. I did not watch this when it was on, so it's funny watching it now, like back in the day compared to now and seeing where they've come. And it's really, really funny. I'm on like season eight, so I'm gonna have breakfast and watch this. All right, so I just finished my breakfast and I'm gonna do a uh, walk with Lou, do some work, and then I'll check in with you guys when I make lunch. So see you at lunch. All right guys, so it is four and a half hours later and we're gonna be making lunch and we are making a high protein lunch. Obviously, you guys know that's my drill and that's my vibe, um, but we are making a tuna salad wrap and this is so filling, delicious, amazing, and then a little side veggies, fruits, you're gonna see the whole thing of course. Now this meal, I calculated it, I'm gonna show you in a sec, but it is 62 grams of protein. So this is very dense in protein. It's gonna help balance my blood sugar for the whole afternoon. It's gonna prevent any snacking before dinner. And that is the key. I truly believe um, getting, not being afraid to get in a really dense, calorically amazing meal filled with lots of protein, fiber, fats, uh, carbs, the whole thing is the secret to staying fuller for longer. And snacking is the worst thing that you can do for yourself if your goal is just overall health, if you wanna lose fat, if you wanna lose overall body weight, um, balance your insulin, like all these kind of things because people that snack constantly, you become in time pretty much insulin resistant in my own experience and opinion. So now I'm gonna just flip this around and show you the ingredients in my tuna salad sandwich. You're gonna be adding in some carrots, celery, red onion into the tuna. And this is a tuna that I personally love. I get this from Costco, just a solid white tuna. And the macros basically, come up nice and close, let it focus, focus, come on. I don't know why it's not focusing. Anyways, basically for a quarter of this can, it's 13 grams of protein. We're gonna be eating this whole can. This is a regular size can. People probably think I'm nuts, but trust me, it's amazing. And we're using my fave wraps. This is from Flat Out. This is their protein wrap, and this is the red pepper um, flavor. And the macros are amazing. You have 10 grams of protein in this wrap. It's 120, 30 calories for the whole thing. 22 grams of carbs and just overall macros are great. So these are my favorite wraps for um, making sandwiches. And this is what we're gonna be using for my tuna salad sandwich. This is my favorite mayonnaise. It is made with 100% avocado oil. It is organic, it is amazing. And the ingredients are awesome. So you can see it has avocado oil, egg yolks, there's no canola, it's just absolutely amazing. And of course, mayonnaise is very high in fat, so you gotta be really careful, again, portion control. One tablespoon is 100 calories and 11 grams of fat. So the goal is, of course, enjoy everything in moderation, mayo included. So this is our fat source for this meal. yummy tuna sandwich it is so delicious so I basically added in just a couple handfuls of each of the cucumber or sorry each of the celery carrots and onion and then I just mixed it and add some Tabasco and I made enough meal prep so if I want to chuck this into salads or make another tuna salad sandwich later in the week I literally have a huge container ready. So I always like to make things that I can add on and prep for other days in the week to make life easy. This can be like little add-ons in my salad, like I mentioned, or you put this in a stir fry, um, or even obviously just make another tuna salad sandwich. So this is great already for meal prep. And then now I'm gonna go show you my full lunch. Okay guys, this is my full lunch. You saw my nice tuna wrap, another little close up and obviously a full glass of water. And then this is like a little salad. So this is basically like cabbage, um, shaved carrots. Um, I have leftover steamed green beans. So I chuck that in there and then some cherry tomatoes from my grandfather's garden. And then I just put some of my homemade dressing on. This recipe is my Honey Dijon dressing lemon vinaigrette that is on my membership program. And I will link above the um, info for my app. So that's part of my lifestyle program. So the dressing's in there, but you can really add any dressing you like. 
So this is basically lots of extra veggies. You can th see there's a theme, I eat a lot of veggies. And then for dessert is like a cute little, nice little bowl of berries. So we have some strawberries, some blackberries and raspberries. So this will be my dessert. So I'm gonna sit down and have my lunch. finished lunch and I am stuffed oh my gosh that is the one bonus about eating high protein meals filled with fiber all your healthy macronutrients your carbs fats protein and I am so satiated and I am not going to be hungry for hours and that is like the recipe for success and your fat loss journey weight loss journey transformation journey and overall health um, so that is one great tip that I hope you can take away from this what I eat in a day so now I'm going to insert what I meant to insert earlier which is what I do for my lemons I did that right after I ate breakfast and that's how I prep for having really great lemon juice fresh um, for the week for basically my morning lemon water and my vinaigrettes recipes etc so it's like ready to go um, so yes prepping is the key to success so I'm going to show you and insert that right now finish all my rest of the afternoon things and then I'll see you guys at dinner all right guys it is time to start making dinner and I am making my fave dinner it is homemade chicken nugs so chicken nuggets in the air fryer and that air fryer right over there <laughs> is from Amazon it's from my most recent Amazon haul I'll link that above for you I really do love it I haven't learned all the modes yet but the ones I have used I really love and then I'm making my cheesy roasted potatoes. They are so delish. Um, and then some peas is my side dish for my greens, veggies. Um, and then I'll show you obviously what I'm gonna have for dessert. So first let's whip up the dinner. Okay, so starting off, I have my pan. We have some onion, minced garlic, olive oil. I'm gonna sprinkle in there. And then I'm gonna let that saute, add the peas. And then basically what you do is you add chicken stock as the peas soften and absorb it. And then you keep adding more chicken stock you know, you get it to cook, absorb, and you just do that until you have the right consistency that you love. So I'm gonna whip that together now, and then we're gonna get ready on the potatoes. Okay, so while the peas are sizzling, I have gone ahead already and sliced up my little mini potatoes. I get these from Costco, and then they're in water. I'm gonna boil this, because the key to crispy potatoes is you have to boil them first. So we're gonna boil that and let that boil. So we're doing multi-task, so everything times together. So letting that boil while these cook, and then we're gonna add the peas. little nugget, like chicken nugget cubes and then in this bag I just put some corn flour so this is gluten free chicken nugs so now basically I toss all that in there rub it around and then we're gonna put them in the air fryer and then I'll show you what I do after that So there's my crispy, cheesy roasted potatoes, the peas, and my air fryer chicken nugs with some honey mustard for like a little dipping sauce, and then obviously water. And I'm so excited to eat this. It smells amazing.
All right, guys, so I just showed you what I'm gonna eat. So I'm gonna do a taste test with you guys. So I'm gonna have a chicken nug. Dip it in there. Mmm. So I had dinner, it was delicious, ate that whole plate. And then now I'm having some of my little favorite hazelnut squares with a full Honeycrisp apple, just nicely sliced up, can't let them touch. <laughs> and this is the um, Italian hazelnut wafers that I love. They are delicious. So having that with a chamomile tea is gonna pour the water. So chamomile in there. And then this is my after dessert stock. So I'm just gonna show you now because then I can sign out this video right after this. So I have two Golai gummies right after I finish all of this. Then I have one capsule of Center Zinc, which is ATP Labs' Zinc. Um, Center Mag, which is ATP Labs, uh, their magnesium blend, glycinate blend, and then vitamin C, which is their Center C. And again, all of my supplementation I've taken today will be listed um, down in the description box. I'll outline for you guys really clearly from morning till night. And my discount code for ATP is Abby10. It'll be down in the description box as well. So, oh, and then I also have a Golai -like gummy discount code. And um, I'll have that down in the description box as well. So all these things, again, I only align with brands that I love and I've been working with these brands for like so many years because I absolutely love them. These are like my go-tos every night. So now, Boil the water. I'm gonna pour that in. All right, guys, so all of this is my last food and meal for the day. And of course, I just mentioned my supplementation. And then I'm gonna sign out this video right here. So I'm gonna watch some TV, spend time with Louie and my hubby Daniel, and then go to sleep. So have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my wedding in a day. And if you want me to do more in the future, you guys know, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much. You guys are the best. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.